A searing new audit has been released about an artificial intelligence company and its ties to the Utah Attorney General's office. This is an update to a story Fox 13 broke two years ago. Fox 13's Ben Winslow has an update from Capitol Hill. A special commission set up by the Utah State Auditor has concluded that claims made by the artificial intelligence company Banjo didn't match up with reality, and they had a multi-million dollar contract with the state. Now, Banjo was a company that claimed to take social media posts, 911 call information, traffic cameras, and other government data mixed with artificial intelligence to create a near real-time alert system for law enforcement about emerging crises. When Fox 13 first reported on the system in 2019, Republican and Democratic lawmakers here on Capitol Hill were concerned it went too far. The House Majority Leader went so far as to call it North Korea-esque in its surveillance. That led to funding cuts and audits. Today, the state auditor says a lot of what Banjo claimed it could do wasn't actually reality. This is one of those challenges with any type of uh, new or emerging technology. There's the pitch and the promise of what it could be versus kind of reality of what it is and stuff, especially as you're in the development process. But it did not have, it did not appear to have the capabilities that were advertised at the time that we were evaluating it. In a statement, the Utah Attorney General says the report confirmed what it always knew, that private information was not at risk. Attorney General Sean Reyes also defended Banjo, saying that the system, if fully built out, would have saved lives, and they will continue to use new tech to keep Utahns safe. Now, Banjo really isn't around anymore, and contracts with the state have been suspended. The state auditor has also released a list of privacy guidelines for government to consider as they look to use future technology. We've posted the full audit for you to see at fox13now.com. On the Hill, Ben Winslow, Fox 13 News, Utah. The controversy over Banjo has led to some changes to Utah law. The legislature passed a bill that creates a data privacy officer in the state to review government contracts with technology to ensure people's information is protected. That bill was signed into law by the governor.